If you are an empath, you might feel that you don't belong in this world. You realize that the normal of this world, this society that we live in, is the opposite of the normal of our spirit. The world we live in does not suit the human spirit, but the ego. And when you are an empath, you are able to pick up on energies, you are able to sense energies, and you realize that this world is in need of great repair. The things that people call normal are not at all normal. Everything that goes against your spirit has been normalized. Misery is not normal. To live in fear is not normal. Your true nature is pure love. It is just a state of being and we are not here to follow the normal. We are here to create the new normal. The new normal of being your authentic self in a world where everyone is acting fake. So as an empath, you are not here to fit in the world. You are here to anchor the frequency of new earth. And this is the time to speak your truth. Your individual actions make a huge impact on the collective consciousness. So this is why don't be afraid of speaking your truth. And when you speak your truth, it's natural that people will hate you for that because the truth doesn't impress people. It pisses them off. And it's natural for people to hate you for speaking the truth because of the defense mechanism of the ego. The people who have accepted the normal of the society without even questioning, they have given space to all these low vibrational programs to dictate them. And one of the major program is fear. And when a person lives in fear, they automatically start living in separation, which is the basis of ego, that we are separate, we are not one. And when a person who is living in fear listens to the truth, he is unable to accept that. Because if they accept that, they will realize that their entire life was based upon a lie. The majority of people who follow the normal of the society, the norms, their life is not even theirs. Everything is borrowed from the society their dreams, their ambitions, everything. It's not who they are because the very purpose of the system that we are living in is to dull down your human spirit. It's like they want you to act opposite to your nature. It's like it wants you to live in reverse. It's like that when you are a lion, they want you to think that you are a sheep. And when you start pretending something that you are not, automatically you are living a false life. How can a lion live a sheep's life? It's not just possible. But that's how we have been living in a mechanical way, a robotic life. That's not who we are. And if we see this world as a matrix, we are the chosen one. We are here to uplift the vibration of this planet. And all you have to do for that is be your authentic self. Just be yourself like in nature. No animal tries to be another animal. No flower tries to be another flower. A rose is a rose. A lotus is a lotus. And when they try to become one another, they lose their individuality. And when they are just themselves, they are automatically beautiful. In their ordinariness, they are special. All you have to do is drop all the programs of the society, especially the program of fear. And as you go within and as you start working on yourself, find your authentic self, who you truly are. And you just have to express that. And just by being that, you inspire people. You awaken others. The people can see the spark in you. So if you are an empath, realize that you are the chosen one. The one who is here to anchor the new world. You are here to break the generational cycles. So don't let the normal of the society stop you from creating the new normal of your spirit. You have to be the calm in the chaos. You have to be awake in an asleep world. Much love to you all.